no, we're gonna have to deal with this guy, aren't we? And you can see we're getting wood, but we're also getting hello. We're, we're getting idiot shellbacks who are now gonna provide us with hide because Just working away here. Getting some more healing potions made up. Mm -hmm. uh, no, you're not. You're faking it. We don't have the stuff to make. Oh, never mind. Hello, everyone. <laughs> no, Trigon here with Growler, who is being strange today. Oh, welcome back to Conan Exiles. Don't forget, if you like the video, tickle that thumbs up button and smack the keyboard and make a lot of noise like I just did. No, no, don't do that. <laughs> subscribe if you haven't already so welcome back okay so we just finished up uh doing all of uh, our upgrades and getting some more iron and all of that good stuff um oh I, I was gonna put lights and stuff in i forgot oh well we'll get to that we're gonna get some decor going in here and get this place looking nice before we uh, uh abandon it <laughs> okay not abandon it be before we decide to move up north uh, it's always terrible, you know, you get the place all looking nice and everything, and then it's time to move on. But we have a, actually have a level here, so let's go ahead and get this done. We want to get our agility pumped. Okay, so we've got one more point. Where can we pump that? Let's pump it in accuracy. Okay, so we got uh, his agility, Growler's agility up to five, so his armor will be more effective now. Now let's get some feats going. Browder's already got two of them. Ha 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 ha. Very funny. Uh, Aquilonian armor. We are going to want to get into this at some point. That'll be nice. Not only will Growler look really BA in it. I mean, it looks BA in the armor he's in now. But this armor um, uses steel instead of iron, so it's more effective. It's still medium armor, but it's more effective. But for right now, I want the carpentry table. Oh, do we want the carpentry table yet? Hmm. That's a good question. What do we want next? It's mainly decorative stuff we can get. The Aquilonian armor we can get. Carpentry table. Yeah, I think carpenter table is what we want next. And we still have a point. I've never had any luck making candles because I've never seen a lot of the material for making them. Um, oh, tables. We'll unlock tables. Okay, cool. Whoa, what on earth? I have a feeling we're in a sandstorm. <laughs> You're in a menu, minding your own business, and the next thing you know, it's pitch black and you can't see anything. Yep, sandstorm. That's one thing. Once we get, it's sort of nice and easy here. You know, sandstorm comes through, no problem. You head up north, uh, even where we were gathering iron, you get up there and the sandstorm hits, you better find cover because you will start taking damage from it. Oop, come on, close the door. All right, let's get this carpenter table built. What are we going to need here? We are going to need wooden stone. Okay, not, not anything spectacularly difficult. Let's go get a little bit of stone gathered. I believe that's enough stone. We'll pack that away inside here for now. Uh, where to put it? Put it in here, I guess. Oh, we already had a bunch of stone in here, too. Oh, well. Alright, let's go get some wood. Uh, let's go through the wrong doorway. <laughs> uh, get our hatchet out. Say, I, I believe, what was it? It's like 400 wood or something ridiculous. It's going to take us a little bit to gather enough wood for this. <clears throat> so, yeah, once... Uh, I mean, this map is just huge. Uh, I think I read where... Did I read where they planned to add mounts after release? 
I think I did. I, I hope they do add mounts because, man, traveling around this map is slow. And, uh, like, oh, great. Now we're encumbered. Well, we're close to the house at least. Um, like, for, to make steel, we need, um, we need, uh, brimstone. And, uh, Really the, there's only one source of brimstone I've even found so far. <laughs> and that's near to here. It's right up here in these mountains, uh, you know, at the foot of the desert, in the high desert. Um, I haven't seen any up in the green area, and I've been exploring, looking around for it. Uh, I understand there is, what, Brimstone Lake or something, or I get, which I guess is the best place to get it. Do we have enough wood for this? Yeah. Um, but I haven't even found that there yet. And it's, you know, so far to travel for doing all this stuff. And it helps if you go to the right container. Excellent. Yep. Take that out so it'll... There we go. Put that away. Need all of that stone. Yep, half of it. Don't need bugs. Alright, excellent. Let's see if this will fit over here. Oh yeah, we really need to work on... Oops, wrong room. We really need to work on the uh, lighting, don't we? Uh, you know, that'll probably work okay. That'll work out. Let's get some lighting in here. Grab all this iron out of here. Here, and let's get some decent lights now that we actually have iron to make them. Uh, let's make three of them. Much as I hate to use up so much of my iron, but we really need the lights. Badly. Can't see a thing in here. Okay. okay let's put this guy right. Let's see. Let's actually let's go in first person. It'll probably be a lot easier. <laughs> there we go. Okay, excellent. That's one. This one right here in the middle, or should it be over here? Uh, I don't know. Actually, let's put one in here and we'll worry about the other one in a moment. Three, four. So we want it right here. Okay. Maybe this downstairs. Yeah, we'll save and we'll just use the small ones for that downstairs area. Here we'll put... Ooh! We can't put one up here. Unless we... Okay, so I guess we will put it down here because I don't feel like screwing around with the other bit right now. We'll put it right there. Okay. Let's put that away. Get back into our normal view. Normally I don't use third person view. Well, I don't use it. Oops. I should be able to pick this up. There we go. The uh, braziers. Do I have a brazier in here? No, I don't. Okay. Um, I mean, in Ark, I always stay in first-person view. I don't really like the third-person view much. But for this game, I really like using the third-person view a lot better. Excellent. Yeah, that worked out really nicely bit dark here in this corner, but that's fine. Did I misjudge the size of the space? One, two, three. I did. That's why it's so dark there, because it should have been a little further away. Can I pick this back up? Yes, I can. Love the things you can pick up. <laughs> I was going to say, where'd it go? Boy, it took it a moment to, to show up there, didn't it?
Um, hello? There it is. Why is my game lagging? My laptop doing something funky? It's still dark over here, but, well, it's better than it was. Front door is a bit dark. I'd probably put a torch outside of some sort. Let's see. Do I have... Yeah. Well, i got to make a regular torch, but we do actually have the stuff for that. Ooh. Let's grab part of our char charcoal here. Okay. Now, what do we need? Ugh. Can't move. A torch. Okay, we want the regular torch. We'll craft one of them. Plus that in there. Whoops, no, not that. Torch. Actually, that's it. We should make a second one of those, too. So let's... Now we can make... This guy. Craft. While that's going, let's... Make ourselves a full-fledged torch. It'll last longer. Than the improvised one. Take this guy... Let's put it outside here. Somewhere. So where's a good spot for it? Okay, much better. Yeah, I always you always used to be bothered by the by the uh first person view games. They were so hard to get used to when you're used to playing in a third person view. There we go. There we go. Our front door is lit up. And that'll light up that space there, too. So this will still be dark at night up here, but yeah, we're a lot better lit now. We're in a lot better shape. Go ahead and put that there. Uh, we'll go ahead and... Eh, I don't even want to... No, I'm just going to toss the improvised torch. We'll never use it again. They're all very well and good, but... I'll go ahead and take... Let's see, actually... I wish we had pull function. Oops, not what I wanted. Wish we had pull function, like, like from S Plus on Arc. That would be really nice. Okay, so sticks... Uh, nope. Sticks, those are the ones I want. And we'll take... How much iron do we have? Do we have enough where I can afford to... We have some laying around, too, that we've been using for stuff. Okay, yeah. We're going to have to make another iron run soon, but... We'll live. Oh, I don't have the skill yet! Ah, I forgot. I was going to get Growler some iron arrows, but I forgot we got to get the crossbow skill for that. Okay, well, that's going to wait till we level up again. <laughs> <laughs> but hey, we got all the other stuff going, right? Get out and enjoy our vista. Oh yeah, look at that. Look at that. That is just too awesome. Actually, that is really pretty. Oh, let's see if I can get the right. That is really pretty. <laughs> okay, enough enough crouching and hitting the wrong buttons. Uh, can I get my taskbar back? There we go. Alright. <clears throat> so, what's next? Actually, we've accomplished so much. Uh, we need to do decor still. Uh, we haven't done thralls yet, but I'm sort of... I don't know. I, I don't know if I want to get any thralls here... No one, we're going to move up north. And it takes a lot of materials. It's going to take 100 iron to uh, build the uh, wheel of uh, um, convincing. <laughs> wheel of pleasure? 
I don't know. I just don't like calling it the Wheel of Pain, okay? That's all there is to it. Let's see here. I do want to get this done. Actually, this would be nice because we can start getting uh, ice shard arrows. And that'll be very handy, too. And this we can do. It's just stone and wood and uh, twine, which we've already got. Do we have enough of this stuff? We might. Let's try this. We are short stone. Oh, uh, goodness. Heavy, too. Okay. Uh, no, not, not you. You, you, you. You can go right there. Although we're not really... We don't really need to carry uh, stone and wood much anymore. We're not... Uh, we're not using any stone we need to carry wood but we're not using any stone tools anymore so you don't need to carry that for maintenance purposes which is great Good. So with this, we'll get ourselves a shrine to Emir built. There we go. Right there, oh, we got a little extra iron out of that, didn't we? Toss us in here for the next time we're smelting. Okay, I'm thinking straight ahead. What do you think? Uh, uh, uh. Come on. Oh, the door closed on me. I'm trying to get in the door because I want to try to place it so that it's. straight outside the door. There. I like that. <clears throat> One of the things that's a bit of a nuisance about the, sh the shrine is this lip around it. And if you set it at its default height, you have to jump up on it every time you want to go in there. Okay, so here now... Ooh, venerate the gods. Another step. So now we can, we can make ice shard arrows. We just need to get some ice shards. And we need iron and s branches for that. So actually, let's just take all these branches and stick them in there. <laughs> Stupid bird inside the rock. I saw somebody else uh, doing some building in Conan. And they weren't raising their foundations up, so they had grass sticking to their floor. And I'm sitting there looking at them going... Just, just raise it. Raise it. What are you doing? Raise it up. Uh, actually didn't need to do anything with this, did I? Let's just grab an extra 15, so... Whoop. Okay. There. I need to, I need to change the, uh, the run lock key, because having it as the num lock is just a bad idea. For those of us who are used to using the R... Our number keypad. <laughs> I mean, it cannot be moved. That's iron bars, right? All right, let's just do it this way then. Raft. So I suppose we, this would have been a, a cheap hatchet we could have gotten earlier on had we wanted to. All right. So. If you haven't done this with the Emir yet, you can see once you have your your uh, your uh, what is it called again? Your Horfrost hatchet. No, we're gonna have to deal with this guy, aren't we? You can see we're getting wood, but we're also getting hello. Wood, wood, 
getting idiot shellbacks who are now going to provide us with hide because, well, no, they're not because I hit the wrong button. <laughs> uh, let's go deal with this guy. He'll provide us with hide. Hey, you. You'd think he would provide us with something other than hide, you know, some sort of, I don't know, shell. Keratin, I guess, is what it would be. Don't want that. 28 of those. Okay, so you see we got these ice shards from that. We can use... Oh, for goodness sakes. Go away. Can't you see I'm trying to make a recording? Why do you have to keep interrupting? Alright, let's see if I can get enough of these to get us some ice shard arrows. So this thing isn't really good for, for gathering resources. Uh, I can get a lot better, uh, a lot more wood with uh, the regular iron hatchet. But I'm not getting any ice shards to speak of, too. Maybe you get more from the, the pine trees up north? It could be. On my single player game, I haven't been down here in a while. What am I? I'm using the right hatchet, but we're not getting any ice shards. There we go. There's two more. Wow. Yeah, I guess you really do get a lot more uh, uh, up north because uh, I'm, I'm able to get enough ice shards up there that uh, I can keep myself in ice shard arrows unload all this other stuff we picked up which is good we need the branches so that's really good because uh, you need the branches obviously to make the arrows so it's really handy that it gave us a bunch of branches actually didn't give us all that many did it actually let's leave the wood in here and we will keep half of that um, oh you know what no I want to take these out so we can use them for the ice shard arrows. But what we will do is start crafting up some wood planks. But this... I like how that came out with it being under the... Under the grass like that. Actually, probably could have done with lowering it a little bit more. But it looks great from this angle. It just looks like that's a standing stone right there. This in here, cook it up, I'll toss this in here, cook it up. But I tell you, getting the, uh, getting thralls is really nice though, especially you get some higher level ones you can speed up, uh, speed up your resource production and reduce your resource costs very nice I really need to get somebody need to get uh, uh, um, it's a you know once we get our permanent house made up north uh, I want to definitely get some our, like a, a blacksmith and uh, somebody to run the furnace and ones like that where we can really, you know, make use of that reduced reduced cost on stuff. We're getting anywhere. There's a couple more ice shards there. I just want to give it enough to... Okay, we got we got enough. We got a lot more that time. Uh, <laughs> I'm stuck. There we go. I wanted to get enough to make some, some arrows to show you the ice shard arrows. That's all. That's all I wanted. Nothing fancy. some of those there great we got enough to make 20 little double our store of arrows here actually that's not what I meant to do I meant to come on there 
and it starts creating manifestations of zeal when you produce things in here so that's really handy too it's all right uh, let's put the wood in here that there actually we don't need to carry stone anymore so I can get rid of that Sticks, try to keep a few sticks on us and stuff. We'll toss the stone in here for now. Don't really need these at the moment, but we might be able to make use of them at some point. In the meantime, they're an easy way to use up that wood. But all right, I think that's going to have to be it for today. Um, I'm not sure what we're going to do next time. I mean, we don't want to do the decor, but I don't know if I want to spend a whole lot of time on an episode just doing decor. I'd rather just do it off screen and then, you know, show it off to you once it's done. Um, and we do need to start working on getting up north. I need to get some more levels on us. Some more levels on Growler, I should say, so that we can uh, survive better going up north. Get some more skills. So uh, I think I need to, you know, get some off-screen stuff done so that uh, we can be prepared for our move because I think that is going to be our next big thing. That's going to be the next big operation that we're going to be doing. And then this is just going to be our southern outpost here. But at least we do have it set up nicely. You know what? You know, I was thinking I wasn't going to do thralls here, but it just dawned on me. I do want to do thralls down here. I at least want to have a setup down here where we could do thralls, because that way, if we're down here and we find nice, decent level thrall that we want to tame, we can bring them back and drag them into here, because you only have so much time to get someone back to your base. you got to have something nearby. So yeah, that's going to definitely be in our next episode. So that's it for today. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please remember to tickle that thumbs up button. And if you haven't already, please subscribe and we will see you next time. Have a great day, everyone.